Welcome back to the channel, everybody. I hope you guys are having another awesome day. It's Rick coming back at you. In today's video, I am dropping a truth bomb. This one's going to hit you hard, but if you get the message out of it, you are going to be a lot better off, and of course, you will be on track to hit the goals that you have, but... Before I get into this truth bomb, you want to make sure that you are subscribed and that you hit the bell notification as well. I am giving some basic information for helping you condition your mind for success, but also some tips and strategies that might help you get where you want to go financially as well. So if that's something that interests you, you want to make sure that you are subscribed and that that bell notification is on because I'm dropping a new video a day and a new YouTube short a day. And this stuff is ultimately to empower you to become that person that you've envisioned for a really long time. So truth bomb time, are we ready? So we talk a lot about success and we talk about some key differences. What separates somebody who's really successful from somebody who ultimately wants to be successful, but they just can't find success. And the main difference of somebody who's successful versus somebody who's not is the person that's successful never feel sorry for themselves. Never. They don't allow themselves to go into this mindset of I feel bad for my myself. I'm, this is a terrible situation. And they start sympathizing with themselves internally. Like successful people don't do that because they know that that's a problem that needs a solution. And by them sitting there lingering in this self-pity, saying, poor me, blah, 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 isn't that they're not drawing up a solution. So what they find themselves doing instead is if something comes up that they don't expect, like they just lost a lot of money in an investment, or maybe their girlfriend just broke up with them or whatever, they use that as motivation to continue moving forward to hit their goal that they want. It's like, think about this. The majority of the successful people, they always have a story back of what's motivated them. And more times than not, there's always some sort of either tragedy or trauma behind it that has propelled them to their success. They reached a breaking point where they were like, oh, I'm just so sick of this, right? Like, I'm sick of not having money. I'm not sick of being where I want. And instead of feeling bad, they use it as a catalyst and a catapult to get where they want to go. And they don't allow any excuses or self-pity to hold them back. Now, somebody else on the flip side of that who's not successful, they would look at a situation where maybe they lost money in an investment or a girlfriend broke up with them or whatever. And they then dwell on it for the next fucking five years or whatever because they need somebody to feel bad for them. And if nobody else will feel bad for me, then I'll feel bad for myself. And they never motivate themselves to realize that that was only an experience that's there to teach you a lesson. So grab the lesson out of the experience and move forward. But unsuccessful people don't realize that. So they stay where they're at. So you want to understand this because maybe you're questioning yourself right now and going, do I do that? Because maybe you do and maybe you don't. But understand that that's the main difference in somebody who's reaching goals as compared to somebody who's not. They're not leaving excuses. They're not feeling bad for themselves. They're taking every adversity in stride and they're moving forward. So if you can condition yourself to have that same attitude, it's only a matter of time until you hit your goals. So I wanted to share that with you guys because you probably have heard that before, but you know how I like to do it. It's, it's straight in your face. I don't sugarcoat anything. I want to give it to you the way it needs to be given because sometimes it just takes the straight, right forward at you type approach for you to realize that something isn't working. So here it is. So um, if you guys did enjoy this video, again, you want to make sure to give it a thumbs up and then hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell notification because you are going to get raw in your face content that's going to help you become the best version of yourself, stop using excuses and become the best version of yourself as well. So you want to make sure that you don't miss any content that I'm putting out because you are a goal achiever, you are living your best life, and you're doing it in stride epically. So I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day and take care.